Welcome back to the channel. My name is Miss Peanuthead and it's time for another Makeup Review Monday. So, I got a new palette. It's not like new, brand new. It's new to me. It is the NYX Avant Pop palette. I'm trying to get it so the glare isn't there. It's not worth it. But oh my gosh, this is beautiful. I want to open it so you guys can get a little bit better feel for the colors. And then I will be putting swatches of these up as well. Um, but I'm they're probably gonna be on the side of the camera. You'll you'll see you'll figure it out. You're smart people. But uh, the look that I have on my eyes right now is from this palette. And I just want to talk a little bit about it. Um, I love NYX products like so much. They are wonderful. They're really great for the price that you get. I have a ton of different products from them, range from lip products to, I have a few face ones. I usually stick to their lip products because those seem to be the best bang for your buck, in my opinion, as it comes across like their other stuff. I just purchased some of the lingerie lip, matte lips that they have, they came out with. Um, I'm really excited to get those. I have the Ultra Matte Lip Creams and I totally love them. They work so well. They're very comfortable, not too drying. They have good range, like good range of colors. They just came out with a bunch more colors. So I definitely am hoping it's kind of in the same feel as those. So when those come in, obviously I'll probably do another video on those and I might do some lip swatches. I don't know, I'm gonna try to feel it out. We'll see. But I think I got I got two of them. So nothing nothing crazy. I wanted to make sure I liked them before committing to the whole like shebang, you know. But this is an excellent palette. I think I got it at Ulta for $16, I think. I think that's how much I paid for it. And I kind of did like some light swatching in the store. I just wanted to get a feel for the darker colors because I saw this beautiful green one. It's like a foresty green. And I was like, oh, that looks fabulous. And I swatched it and it's beautiful. Oh my gosh. These are super soft and super pigmented. I was very, very impressed with this one. I think they have three different like Avant Pop uh, palettes. This one is Nouveau Chic. I think it's the third one. And on the back it has like a day look and a night look. Um, I don't believe in day looks and night looks. I just believe in looks. So I am so over the moon with this. It's beautiful. I cannot wait to kind of just go crazy with these. Obviously I have enough dark look for this evening and by the way the lipstick I'm using is wet from Colourpop oh my gosh guys it's beautiful I saw this online I know I'm going I'm getting a little sidetracked whatever but I saw this online and I was like oh oh that's different totally love it just check them out Colourpop's amazing also coming out with new satin ones ooh, ooh. launch on the 18th ooh, ooh. I'm gonna be buying way too many of those so but back to the actual product I'm talking about today. This palette is wonderful. They have just a really good range of colors. Like these, these are just really pretty colors and they're colors that I don't really have in the other like 12 palettes that I have. I don't have a lot of green. Like I don't know why. I think I have maybe two green shades, like two good green shades. And I saw this and I was like, ooh, forest green mm. I love it I seriously like they're so pretty and they're very easy to blend I mean very easy to blend this does not take an expert makeup artist to create a lot of fun looks with it's it's wonderful it's inexpensive if you're looking for like a good quality and not a lot of money Definitely, I would suggest checking out this palette. Seriously, the shadows are beautiful. I cannot talk highly enough on this palette. <laughs> it's so great. I bought it and I kind of was just like, 
well if it's not very good and these don't blend as well as what they're like looking like and they don't swatch as well whatever I don't care but I'm so happy with this the purple is very similar to a duochrome one that I have in Urban Decay so it'll be really fun to kind of mix those two lavender-ish colors together and just go crazy since it's springtime I feel like I'm allowed to get away with like really bright colors now well it's, it's moving towards spring I don't think it's technically spring yet but I love bright colors obviously I love dark I love dark stuff it's not a problem but it'll be fun to have such a good array of like different styles of colors and I'm just oh, I'm so excited guys it's a beautiful beautiful palette y'all need this in your life I'm telling you you need you need this it's it's so wonderful seriously go buy it now do it do the thing Julie do the thing bye you but I totally love this and I really hope that you guys are gonna go check it out too. If you have anything that you're eyeballing and you're not sure you want to buy yet, please let me know because it might be something that I'm considering buying and I would love to do a review. So if it's a waste of money, you're not wasting your money. Um, I can always find a way to make pretty much anything work. I've had very few things that I just didn't like. but that's about it okay guys i will see you in the next video toodles